Hi everyone, it's Tatiana from Tatiana's Everyday Food and welcome back to my kitchen. Today I'm sharing a delicious dinner recipe that you can have ready in 30 minutes. I'll be showing you guys how to make my chicken burrito stuffed with avocado, pineapple, mozzarella, and I'll be making a cilantro and avocado dipping sauce to go with it. Let's get started and I'll show you how to make this delicious dish. Before I start on my chicken burritos, I wanted to make my cilantro and avocado dip. So I've measured out one cup of sour cream and I'm gonna drop this into my food processor. And you can also use Greek yogurt for this. To my sour cream, I'm gonna add half of a ripe avocado, two garlic cloves, about half a teaspoon of salt, and of course, a large bunch of French cilantro. I'm also gonna drizzle a little bit of olive oil over the top and just a splash of vinegar for some acidity. Cover this up and give this a whirl until I have a smooth dip. And I'm gonna set aside my dip until I'm ready to serve it with my burritos. And now for my chicken. Today I'm using two large chicken breasts and you can also use four chicken thighs for this. Just wanna take a sharp knife and cube the meat into smaller pieces. And this will cut down on the cooking time and also be ready to fill our burritos. I've heated my frying pan over medium heat. I'm gonna drizzle in a little bit of olive oil and then to that I'm gonna add my chicken. You want your pan to be nice and hot. You wanna cook the chicken until it's browned all over, about seven to eight minutes. I have my chicken all brown and now it's time to add the rest of my ingredients. So I've diced one shallot, I'm gonna drop that in. Three minced garlic cloves. I'm gonna add lots of garlic flavor. I'm gonna sprinkle in about a teaspoon of salt. I have half a teaspoon each of smoked paprika, ground cumin, and chili powder and some ground black pepper. And now for the surprise ingredient in my chicken burritos. I'm gonna be adding about a quarter cup of crushed pineapple. Now this is an optional ingredient, but lately I've been really loving this flavor combination of chicken and pineapple. All right, gonna to toss this all together. Oh, this already smells so good. I'm just gonna let this cook for about five more minutes and then we'll be ready to assemble our burritos. And now I have everything ready to put my burritos together. So I'll be using some large flour tortillas. I've also chopped a whole avocado and I have about a cup and a half of fresh mozzarella cheese. You can actually spread some of that cilantro avocado dip right into the burrito. So you have some of that flavor with every bite. Next, I'm gonna add a nice generous amount of mozzarella cheese. I'm gonna add on my chicken. Add some avocado to the top. Oh, I love adding avocado into burritos, my favorite ingredient. Sprinkle some more over the top and then just fold this all together. So you'll want to fold the sides over first. Just like that, perfect. Give a little pat and then assemble the rest of the burritos. So today I'm using a grill pan, but you can also prepare these in a regular frying pan if you don't have a pan like this. So I've heated this over medium heat. I'm gonna drop my burritos right onto my hot plate, give it a nice squish. And after a few minutes, I'm gonna flip these over and grill them on the other side as well. Oh, these look so good. Burritos are all done and I love the beautiful grill marks on these. I just wanted to cut one open for you guys so you can see how good it looks on the inside. And look at that. I love that you can see chunks of chicken and pieces of avocado and that melted mozzarella cheese looks so good. I'm so looking forward to digging in and enjoying these. And that's it guys for my chicken burritos. And I love to get lots of that cilantro and avocado sauce with every bite. It's just so creamy and delicious. Mmm. 
These chicken burritos are irresistible. I love that melted mozzarella cheese, the creamy avocado, and that pineapple. It's very subtle, but it's gonna have your guests asking, what did you put in your chicken burritos? They taste so good. And then combine it with that cilantro and avocado dipping sauce, just amazing. These things are so easy to put together and amazingly delicious. Hope you guys have enjoyed this video recipe. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you next time.